Welcome to jobskillshare.org. This is an introduction video for web design UI UX fundamentals. Now, if you go to indeed.com and you basically search something, let's say UI UX designer, somebody told you that this is a great job that I'm doing, you should do the same thing. Usually they will tell you to start with some kind of education, fundamentals. And this is where you need to start, maybe a book. This is exactly what we are doing now. We have decided to go for this title now. We are going to complete this title just like we do in jobskillshare.org. We first teach you the fundamentals quickly and then move into the real world skills, real world requirement so we can cover what is in the market right now. So when you go to the indeed.com and you type these uh, titles, you get to see these responsibilities, requirements, different type of things. Some may be at senior level, some may be at junior level. Our target is going to be junior level. We're not going to target senior level because this is not how it works. You do need that experience to become a senior level anything. So we're our target is going to be a junior level uh, UI UX designer or UX UI designer. So this is where you will be seeing like something like junior and you can see they are more open for uh, for you for to listen to you that what kind of education have you done what kind of projects have you done how much passion you have for this type of title and this is exactly what we do in other titles like help desk and people have landed jobs from anywhere so many people have landed jobs and that is our goal in this title also we are going to try to do that but without without having a uh, an instructor that's knowledgeable passionate about you know the titles or the job that they're doing it's impossible and now we have that instructor basically Hadia Amjad she will take you into this route if you want to become a UI web U, a web design UI UX designer then this is where you need to start a fundamentals this is a free course I hope you join it and if you have any suggestions if you have knowledge about this title you want to add something we are open to this this is what this platform is about it's a community platform we work together to create the best titles and the best real world job experience that we can give you online and this is why our other titles are going so well like help desk different type of uh, labs that we have for that uh, and trainings that we do so I hope that this will be also another successful title in this jobskillshare.org platform. Now I am going to take this video to Hadia. She will explain the rest. Thank you so much. Hi, everyone. So before we get to the course, I think it's important that you should know why should you be doing this course and what should you be expecting and uh, what this is all about. So um, for this course, we are specifically and particularly focusing on the part of web design which focuses on user interface and user experience and how these two come into web design. See, web design is part of the process of web development and we will be seeing how user interface and user experience come in here in this particular field. Web development is basically divided into design and development. See, for every technical product, it may be an app, a website, or any software. See, there are two parts. One is the part that the user see, that we see when we are using the software, uh, you know, how we're communicating with it. And all the technicalities of the website come or the that product come into the development part see that design part is basically a shield that hides all the technicalities and the hard stuff from us so same as the case with web development there is design and development it's basically divided into design and development and here we are focusing on web design both areas are extremely extensive so uh, you might be wondering why we are studying web design separately or why we are studying a portion of web design separately because these are very extensive for the development. They require separate expertise. You know, you can't just know both things. Basically, when you start web development, you're supposed to know. There's a term used called full stack. You're supposed to know all the design, the front end of the site and the back end. But as you grow into the field, you might be specializing in one of the parts. Design approach. See, um, not everybody has a design approach. And if you think 
you're designing, if you like your design, you should know that you're not designing for yourself. You're designing for other people. So there are a lot of conventions that come in here. Then UI UX concepts are vast. They're like lengthy and they require a lot of research and time. And you just cannot do them both if you're in development and design both. And the same is the next step that it's the evaluation that it's a lot of stuff should be evaluated before the final product and it's not easy to just do them entirely in one go there must be stages after this course hopefully you would know a lot of ui and ux concepts you'll know about design conventions typography is the text and the type of text used in products design elements ux principles and analysis and interaction design process a lot of things about ui ux and hopefully after you're done with this course all you will be needing to do will be learn the proper appropriate software which hopefully i will make a course on so um after this course you'll know how to design basically 